To write the balanced net ionic equation for HNO3 plus CaOH2, that's nitric acid and calcium hydroxide, we'll use these rules here. So the first step is we need to write the balanced molecular equation. And our coefficients for that would be 2, 1, 1, 2. Next, we should write the state for each of the substances unless it's given. HNO3, that's probably going to be aqueous. Calcium hydroxide would be aqueous. This calcium nitrate will be aqueous. And water will be a liquid. We then split the soluble substances into their ions. On the periodic table, hydrogens in group 1, it has a 1 plus charge. And then nitrate, NO3 minus, that's a polyatomic ion with a 1 minus charge. Calcium, group 2, has a 2 plus charge. And then OH, that's the hydroxide ion, that has a 1 minus charge. Over on the other side, we have our 2 plus, our 1 minus, and then water. That's a liquid. It's not going to dissociate. So we have our ions. We can now split everything up into a complete ionic equation. So we have H plus, and I'm not going to write aqueous after everything right now, plus NO3 minus, plus Ca2 plus, plus OH minus, and that's going to yield Ca2 plus plus NO3 minus plus the H2O. We need to take into account the coefficients here and these subscripts as well though. So we have 2 times the HNO3, so we're going to have 2 H plus ions and 2 of the nitrates. Calcium is the same. Hydroxides, we have 2 of those. And then on the product side, we have our 1 calcium and our 2 nitrates here and our H2O. So this is the complete ionic equation. From here, we can cross out what are called spectator ions. These are ions that are the same on both sides of the equation. So we can see that the NO3 minus appears on both sides of the equation. And the Ca2 plus, that does too. So we cross those out, and now we can write our net ionic equation. And that'll look like this. We could further simplify this by removing the two since they're the same for each coefficient. And that would be the net ionic equation for the neutralization reaction of nitric acid with calcium hydroxide. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.